The Mecca Light Rail, built and operated by China Railway Construction Corp, CRCC, has safely transported 2.4 million passengers by running almost 24 hours a day during Hajj Pilgrimage Transport Service in Mecca, Saudi Arabia. The Saudi Mecca Light Rail project line is 18.25 kilometers long, with nine stations, and travels to and from three Hajj areas. In this video, we are going to discuss China and Arabia $16 billion rail in the desert. The video is going to be amazing so make sure you stick to the end. Before starting the video, be sure to smash the like button and subscribe to never miss out on any of our videos. CRCC operated the rail line for 156 hours during a 7-day operating period leaving only 12 hours that the line was not operating, according to a press release sent to the Global Times on Thursday. During peak operation, the one-day traffic volume is equivalent to the sum of the three-day traffic volume of Beijing Railway Station and Beijing West Railway Station during the domestic Spring Festival travel period. The project provides comfortable and convenient transportation services for Muslim pilgrims around the world. The company had operated the light rail, the first one in Saudi, during 2010 to 2014 after the construction was completed, carrying out about 15 million trips with zero fatalities. In addition to the networks in Saudi Arabia, Chinese companies have taken up railway projects in Turkey, Iran, Israel, Egypt, Ethiopia, and Djibouti. According to business intelligence firm Mead, rail contracts worth 16 billion US dollars are set to be awarded in the Middle East and North Africa this year. The longer-term pipeline projects could reach well above 200 billion US dollars. No wonder that the Chinese firms are hoping to cash in on the prospects. It has also dug a total of 840 underpasses to drain rain and floodwaters. Earlier last year, Minister of Transport Suleiman Al Hamdan said he is looking forward to the commissioning of Al Haramain Express train soon as the project was progressing unhindered. Al Hamdan had said the train was a new advancement in the kingdom's transportation sector. The railway that will connect Mecca and Medina is one of the kingdom's most carefully supervised projects. It is one of the top priorities for the government. The project is going on schedule without any delays or hindrance. It will facilitate the transportation between the two holy cities greatly, he had said. The train goes at a speed of 200 km per hour. I was with a group of officials and supervisors of the project and I had checked the station in Rabat. It is complete and ready for operation. The National Manpower is doing a great job as Saudi workers are trained in countries such as Spain, said Al Hamdan. The 450 km long railway is built using the latest technology and most advanced materials. The train has the latest engines and the cars were built using most advanced technology in consultation with international companies, said Al Handen. He had made a tour of the train and traveled between King Abdullah Economic City and Medina during a test ride and was all praise for the train's performance. Platforms are protected by glass barriers whose doors open simultaneously with the train doors to ensure the security of waiting passengers. The elevated stations also have wide ramps for pilgrims to flow out smoothly, backed by lifts that can carry up to 50 persons at a time. Most of the station agents appear to be Egyptian and Saudis. Egyptians with experience in running the Metro of Cairo were recruited to operate the control rooms. Lai Changing, vice general manager of CRCC, said that the light rail system originally planned to run 1,000, 718 trains and actually ran 2,214. A consortium of China Railway and Narinko built the Orange Line Metro in Lahore, Pakistan's second biggest city. Rolling stock maker CRRC supplied Boston's Orange Line with cars made in its plant in the U.S. state of Massachusetts. Six brand new cars, the first of 152 ordered, went into service on Wednesday, the Massachusetts Bay Transportation Authority said in a statement sent to the Global Times. The train which will travel through the Red Sea city of Jeddah is planned to run at a high speed reaching 360 kilometers, 225 miles, per hour and ease traffic of pilgrims between the two sites. In the special period of overseas epidemics, it has demonstrated China's strength, imparted China's experience, and told China's stories. Local Al Raji Construction Group together with France's Alstom and China Railway Engineering won the first phase of the 6.8 billion rail, $1.8 billion, contract for civil works. 
Let us know your opinion in the comment section below. This was all for today. Hope you liked the video. Do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Stay safe and we will be back soon with another video.